Hi, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com. Today I want to share with you clothes pin pom-pom transferring. This is a really great activity for fine motor skills development. You'll need to have pom-poms, a clothes pin, and containers that you're going to transfer the pom-poms into from one to the other. And this is optional, but you can use dice with this activity as well. If you're going to just do straight transferring for maybe younger children, um, you wouldn't need the dice, so we'll just start without that and um, they would just simply pinch the clothespin open, grab a pom-pom, pick it up, and then move it into the other bowl. And they would do that until all of the pom-poms have been moved into the other container. That's the transfer part of this. Um, maybe um, still with the same age group, you could maybe call out a number and just say, let's move. Um, two pom-poms to the other bowl and so they would have to count one, two, like that. You could also, with a little bit older children, uh, use a dice, roll it, and then they would have to move whatever or transfer the same number that's on the dice into, oops, that one stuck to that, into the other bowl. I've lost count so I apologize for that. This might be five, but um, so, but this is excellent for developing that pin pincer grasp and then um, picking them up with that. I wouldn't recommend um, pom-poms that were any larger than this. That might be just a little bit too difficult, but um, this just really works excellent. And of course, if you have a variety of colors, um, children will love that too. For a closed pin, pom-pom transferring activity, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com, and thanks for watching.